hello guys hello beautiful people welcome back to my youtube channel my name is olive jennifer ayokoni okoyene and if you're stopping by for the very first time you are welcome please don't forget to hit the subscribe button to become a part of this beautiful family and to my returning subscribers who are also my family members i love you guys so much i love how you support me i see your likes i see your comments i see all that you do to make sure that this channel is growing and i'm forever indebted to you guys i am happy to have you guys in my corner thank you so much i can't even show my gratitude enough i can't even express it enough but all i have to say is may god bless you amen moving forward i would like to invite you guys to follow my business page on ig at unboxing with boobie there we sell all kinds of female fashion items ranging from clothes to shoes to accessories to jewelries and i'm wearing some of my items here like this head wrap is sold out but we have other scarves that are beautiful beautiful we have other head scarves or head wraps that are very very amazing i also have this very piece from my from the things that i sell this this is available on pre-order it's so beautiful and these earrings are equally available on pre-order so if you need any of these items do well to message us on ig at unboxing with boobies are you guys loving the look are you living for it i just decided to dress for the culture today today is friday and you know then in school when i was schooling in nigeria every friday was like um a casual friday right and people get to wear their natives i'm not talking about uh people doing courses that require them to wear a certain uniform I'm talking about people that have that freedom of dressing so every friday we we always did this kind of like casual friday uh <coughs> weird and then you get to just express yourself wear anything you want and most times people tend to wear their natives yes so i am representing if you guys don't know i am from nigeria from the eastern part of nigeria i am Igbo. i am a proper Igbo babe so today i just decided to dress for the culture are you loving those clothes <laughs> my outfit details are uh, this top was gotten from a store in Abuja from these ready to wear stores. I got it in Abuja in 2021 and it is still giving very well beaded and the material it's not like uh and uh, it's not like a regular material. Then um, what else this neck piece i got it when i went to switzerland one of those handmade stores i don't know but like i really love it and it costed me an arm and a leg but it is fine <laughs> i love what i'm wearing today i just love that i am expressing my culture and also i am what prompted me to dress like this was that flavor released his new album and this morning i was just vibing to it i was like okay why don't i just dress for it because that song is so atmospheric i mean that very album is very atmospheric makes you feel a certain type of way like it takes you back home in <laughs> the speed of light so that was why i decided to dress like this for you my darlings <laughs> let's get right into the main topic of today today you know last time i made a video showing you guys some of my favorite perfumes right and today i am going to show you guys some of my favorite arab perfumes and also the dupes that i have gotten over the years i mean the designers perfume dupes that i've gotten that i really love i'll be showing you guys the dupes and the main perfume i i think i have two that i don't know uh the name of the original perfume because i just saw it on instagram and got it i know it's a designer's perfume but i can't find um the place where i saw it on instagram so i'll show you guys the dupes now and show you and tell you the original perfume the first perfume dupe i have here is this one 
it's called savior <laughs> it's called savior and i got it from an arab perfume store but this is the dupe for dual salvage yeah christian dual salvage i i don't know if i got the pronunciation but this is the dupe as you can see the the bottle is almost the same just like this one is savior <laughs> Is the deal for salvage deal and uh, if I'm being honest it does not last as much as salvage deal last but it's a good deal it is a good like my salvage deal finished like I finished my bottle of salvage deal when last year and nay <laughs> nah <laughs> The price that very bottle is talking in the market now is not for the French hearted. And I was like, why don't I just go for the dupe? I checked an Arab store and saw the dupe. And to be very honest, it's not um, a bad dupe you get. It's not as intense as the original Salvage Dior, but it's a good replacement for that bottle if your own has run down or if you have finished your own, then please do yourself the best good and get this one. It gives exactly what Salvage Dior gives, just that. Uh, is the junior brother, as you can see, it is the savior. Like, it's saving you. <laughs> from the shame of not having salvage Dior if you are really um, a person who loves that scent then you should get this if you don't have the money to replace uh, the original bottle so this is very good it's my savior and i love it i got it from an arab perfume store and it was for like 19 dollars um as opposed to <sighs> 100 and something dollars now that the original bottle sells for this is 19 so hmm, nay i'll hold on to my savior until i can afford the original so this one is by the way the next one is this uh zara okay the next one is this zara red temptation and this latifa perfume this is from Zara and this is from Latifa. This is an Arab perfume. This is from Zara. These are the dupes for Baccarat Rouge. <laughs> you see why people are rubbishing this very scent, Baccarat Rouge, because it has a lot of dupes in the market. I mean, it's a good scent. It's very conventional. It's very sweet. Like everybody wants to wear it. Not everybody, but a good number of people wants to wear it. So I, I don't think that uh, it's a bad thing for other companies to reproduce or produce the dupes. So this one is from Zara and uh, it's very good. I love it. It's very subtle. It's not as intense as the original. It's a very good replacement as well for this salvage, for this Baccarat Rouge. However, it does not last at all. It does not last. Give it like three to four hours, and it vanishes into the thin air. So it does not last at all. That is the only problem with this. But it still gives you that... Um, that's very feeling of Baccarat Rouge. But this Latifa, this Latifa, ah, uh, it do last. It do last, my brother. <laughs> this Latifa lasts and uh, it smells almost like Baccarat Rouge. Almost, you know. They say almost never kills a bed. So it's almost not like. It smells almost like Baccarat Rouge and it lasts this can last you 12 hours okay let me know if i exaggerate let's just say um eight to ten hours okay into eight to eight to ten hours if you layer it well if you uh, like moisturize your skin very well and wear it it's definitely going to last you up to eight to eight to ten hours and yes there are good dupes this sells for 19 19 dollars i think 17. it's cheaper than this because this is it's more affordable than this because i hear it's not good to use the word cheap when describing a product so it's it's more affordable than this this sells for 23 23 euros but this i got it from an arab store and they're pricing um 
was in dollars so this sells for nine seventeen dollars somewhere between 17 and 19. I'm so sure it's not up to 20, but this is for 23. As a, as opposed to this, which sells for 200 and something. So like, these are good deals. That is why I said in my other video that this perfume is definitely going to last me for like two, three years. I have these two. There is no way <laughs> I am finishing this bottle. I wear this one on only special occasions okay uh if you want to get the dupe and you don't know which one to get i hear that there are other dupes in the market as well but if you don't if you don't know the ones to get you can get this one just look towards getting these ones they are very good take it from me another dupe i have here is club the nudes this club the nudes um, from an arab perfume store this is for men but when it comes to creed let me show you the original perfume of this this is creed adventures this this is the original perfume okay so when it comes to creed i think uh it's everybody wears it do you get i i don't think it's only for men because uh, like i said with this um Baccarat rouge this one is equally or it's like traditional you get it's oriental even though it has this woody intense smell it has this woody intense notes in it but i don't think it's meant for only men uh, this one right here is a very good dupe i mean I, I don't even know when i found out about this dupe and got it i started regretting buying this do you get i started regretting buying this because i did not see any difference and it opened you now i'm still looking for a difference to like actually justify the fact that i have the original but i cannot it smells so good like just as Bakara, just as uh, Bakara Rouge, <laughs> just as Creed, it smells as good as Creed. I am not even kidding, and it lasts. But this sells for fifty something dollars. Yes, this lasts. And if you are looking for a very good perfume for men, as in this is this this should be your go-to i don't know how to explain i know that creed is a very common uh, fragrance like once you perceive it you know you've you you had perceived it from somewhere you get like i know that uh if you perceive it from someone you will automatically like remember or recognize that you had perceived it from somewhere in the past it's not like a perfume that you have to start guessing and guessing and guessing it's very common now because it has a lot of um dupes i've worn dupes of creed over the years like i love it and i can i know sometimes you get tired of it you just don't want to smell it anymore but it's something that comes with time maybe <laughs> after three or four months you want to go back to creed and kind of spray it and it's not like an everyday perfume for me or if you ask me i think it's something you should wear once in a while because the smell is very choky and intense right but if you're looking for a good, very good fragrance for men and like a unisex fragrance creed is very good and then if you don't want to just buy the uh the dupes of creed in the market just get this creed this club the nudes it's from an Arab perfume store and it is very nice it smells exactly like creed if you leave that if if you visit someone wearing this and you leave their house your fragrance will still be smelling in their couch like for one week i am not lying to you <laughs> but i i honestly don't fancy creed as much as i fancy baccarat rouge you get i don't even know why i got this perfume i just love i just love the idea of it do you get no not like i love 
the scent like that i wear it sometimes and in fact it's a unisex perfume everybody in my house wears it apart from my <laughs> myself or my husband wear it apart from my child i don't know i'm so indifferent about this perfume but i'm just telling you i just love the idea of having it you get but it's not as though it is my perfume mm -hmm. and this is a very good dupe if you want to get a dupe for creed adventures and you want it to smell like the original creed adventures and last as much as creed adventures last then you should get club the notes and after that i have two other three other perfumes here three other fragrances here from zara that have um that have the original do you get but i don't know the name i i cannot remember so the first one is zara amber fusion this smells very good this is very nice very subtle and feminine yes very subtle and feminine it's for women of course and it's floral yeah so this is very good i cannot remember the name of the original perfume but but if i remember maybe um in my next video concerning perfume i'll talk about it i'll tell you guys or leave leave the comments or write it as a comment on that is post <sighs> I don't know but i'll just try to find out the designer's perfume of this and then write it under the comment section and get back to you guys and this smells very nice as well another one is spirited romance spirited romance from zara is a dupe of an original of an of a designer's perfume that i still cannot remember the name but i know that all these tiktokers you know <laughs> Uh, instagram buddies i know that i have a video of one of them that i saved oh it's been a while so if i find it i'll still leave the name of this one in the comment section of this video and the next one is captivatingly paris captivatingly paris is a zara perfume that has um the original as well from a designer's perfume brand but i just cannot remember the name of that designer's perfume brand i will put it in the comment section i'll write it down there if i find it you know i saved i, I have a lot of saved posts consigning um what's it called sense once i am able to get the name of this one i'll let you know but this smells really good as well uh so right now let me now show you some of the arab perfumes that i really fancy that i love and i think that if you want to get a very good perfume that smells really nice you should equally look towards getting them one thing i love about um arab perfumes is that they are not so expensive right they are very affordable yet they leave you smelling like a million bucks I, it amazes me i call them affordable luxuries like they are very good arab arab perfumes have a place in my heart i love them a whole lot i love that they are affordable and the most the, the best thing about this whole arab perfume thing is that a friend introduced me and i love that a friend introduced me to this like arab perfume <laughs> Thing. i cannot stop buying them they are very good they are something like you can wear every day and smell good every day there are like scents that you don't have to think twice before getting because you know that they are definitely going to bang <laughs> first one is yara i know that everybody knows this perfume everybody knows this perfume and this perfume is one of the perfumes that people are still hating on again i don't know what is wrong with people it's saying eh, everybody's not wearing it we are all smelling the same are you okay you're just a hater <laughs> <laughs> you're just a hater why would you be angry that other people are able to afford the perfumes that you have it does not make sense to me and it can never make sense to me how people behave this way people should stop it that once we enter a room everybody will be smelling the same wear your own or layer it okay get three or 
get two or three perfumes and put on top of it if you don't want to smell like every other person but just keep in mind that nobody opens a company to start making perfume just because of you okay so just get used to people having what you have so that you don't have heart attack one day <laughs> so that you don't have a heart attack okay so yara by latifa it's a very very feminine sweet perfume it's sweet floral fruity okay as in <laughs> This perfume is everything feminine. Everybody likes Ciara. I know everybody loves Ciara. This perfume is a mix of vanilla and floral. It smells really nice. I love it. It's a floral perfume for women. <laughs> also, it gives off this vibe of vacation. On that the coconut tree Miami vibes. <laughs> bikini vibes that is what it gives up it's very fresh and sweet and it has floral notes and vanilla notes as well i love this and I love fragrances that are very smooth and subtle and you love floral fragrances this perfume is definitely for you it's very rampant right now and it's very nice i love it i don't even care whether everybody's wearing it or not i still feel that this is the guy okay another perfume here is this dupe perfume by zimaya from an, an arab perfume store and this perfume is the dupe for a perfume by Mali, right? You can see that they they just copied the the packaging and the bottle. They just copied everything about it. This perfume smells really nice. It smells like vanilla. And if you like vanilla fragrances and scents, then you should definitely get this perfume. The most beautiful thing about this perfume is the packaging. <laughs> It is the packaging. It is very well packaged and beautiful. I just cannot get over how very well uh, created this packaging is. I love the perfume and it is not so expensive as well. It's somewhere around $25 as opposed to the original perfume, right? So this is very good. I got it from an Ara perfume store. As someone who likes vanilla scents, this perfume is definitely for you. <laughs> and another perfume I have here is the White Yara. This is very good as well. Just as good as the Pink Yara. And this smells like um, vanilla and uh, floral as well. I love combining these two together. I don't know if I'm doing it wrongly, but I just love how it makes me feel. I love um, the result of combining this. Like, they are very nice. I love wearing them. Let me even put this one on now. <laughs> perfumes are very nice but the one i love most is the pink yara followed by the white yara and the final one here is this camara perfume i don't know if i got the pronunciation but it's still an arab perfume it has a vanilla note as well and if you love vanilla this perfume is also for you I love Arab perfumes. Like this is very big and the content of this perfume, like the quantity is actually very big, but you see them selling it for a price that, ah, that are so affordable. So that is all I have for you guys today. And please guys, don't forget to follow my business page on IG at Unboxing with Boobies. I already said in the beginning that we sell all kinds of female fashion items, ranging from shoes to dresses to accessories. And from the 6th of December to somewhere around 12th, 13th, we're going to be running a massive sales of up to 50% discounts. Did you hear that? We're going to be selling all the items that we have in store. I will put up the flyer very soon, my YouTube, as well as my IG story and post. 
I will tell you guys the location because we don't have a store for the moment. It's an online store, but we want to um, like we want to do these sales in a way that everybody is able to come and pick or see for themselves, right? So I will attach the location on the flyer and also tell you the time and put a phone number that goes through just so just in case you need to call someone or you will need to place your order or you need to speak to our sales rep directly then you have that opportunity please guys i would like for you i would like for you guys to come through for me and help me to help you we have beautiful things especially shoes and scarves we have scarves we have earrings and we have shoes in store you are going to love them and we're giving them to you for half the price yes you know what the dollar price is saying now you know how expensive things have gotten but we're doing this for us right we're doing this for us so please come through from the 6th of Gen from the 6th of december to somewhere around 12th and 13th we're going to be running the sales and might i add that whoever comes to buy from us gets to go away with a gift a christmas gift how does that sound we have gifts that we have packaged for our customers who are going to come it's going to be a first call first serve kind of situation so you would like to be the first person right so that you don't miss out on all the beautiful things that we have to give to you also tell your family members tell your friends i know that you don't want to be the only one that that we enjoy this hour or you don't want to be the only one that gets to enjoy this hour please tell your family members tell your friends buy for your friends okay buy for them too whatever you see that you like and you think that your friend might like it don't even hesitate to buy it <laughs> All right, I've come to the end of this video and I hope that you find it really helpful and turn on your notification button or turn on your notification bell and tell your friends to subscribe to my channel and also share my post, share my videos, like and comment and I'll see you in my next video. Love you. Mwah. Bye. <laughs>